Hello everyone and welcome to Lavelia's Coloring. How are you all doing? I do hope that you are all doing good, doing great. So before I get started, I do want to let you know that I still have allergies. So please excuse me if I do start sniffling. And also my son Mason is here as I record. So you may hear him in the background. Hopefully not. But anyways, I was tagged to do another adult coloring tag video. And the topic is a colorist first. This tag was created by Jojo of Jojo's Coloring Nook. And I will leave a link to both her channel and her video down below in the video description. So if you are not subscribed to her, please check out her channel and video. And for this tag, there are 10 questions plus a bonus one to answer. And I'll also leave the list of questions down below. So as I answer the questions, I am going to try to color this page, which is from the Halloween coloring book that is illustrated by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. You may recognize this page as one that I picked out to color in another tag video I did earlier called the Halloween color it tag. And there were 12 prompts and I think I have about maybe nine or 10 colorings done. But I also did two buddy colors plus finished two diamond paintings this month. So there's only, I think about three more days till Halloween. I'm gonna see in the next few days if I can get a couple more colorings in. But anyways, uh, we'll go ahead and get started with the questions. Okay, so the um, first question is, what was the first coloring book you bought when you started adult coloring? So I started in 2015, so I had to look back um, in my Amazon purchases, my orders, and I found out that I actually ordered two books at the same time. So the two books are Angie Grace Mandala book. This one's the balance one and then Art Nouveau Creative Haven Animal Designs. This is illustrated by Marty Noble. So these two books were actually my first coloring books uh, when I started adult coloring. So number two is, what is the first supply you bought? So the first supply I bought is the Pentel color pen set. I believe there are 24 colors and that's what I use to color in the Mandala Angie Grease coloring book. And I don't use it that much, it's still pretty juicy. I might use it for maybe the lines, dots, and spirals. Um, I do have a couple in my uh, wish list so Maybe I can use it for that one because it's still pretty good, still juicy after five years. So, now question number three is my first non budget friendly set of colored pencils. And it's actually my first set of colored pencils. And it, they are the 48 count of Prismacolor Premier colored pencils. And I remember being so scared to, you know, because they're so creamy uh, to blend with them, to really use it, you know. I colored so light with those <laughs> pencils because I didn't want to sharpen them. And yeah, so when I first colored, I was very light, which I can show and this Art Nouveau with the Prismacolors. So this is Prismacolors and yeah, it was very light um, coloring. Yeah, I, I use the Prismas differently now, so <laughs> yeah. So number four is my first hardback book, coloring book I bought, and that would be the Hannah Carlson Daydreams. That is my first hardback book. So number five is who was your first buddy color with? My, I actually had a couple buddy colors. Um, my actual first one where we finished the 
illustration, finished coloring the illustration is um, a coloring from the Maui Mermaid and Island Whimsy Girls by Hannah Lynn. And I did a buddy color with Philomena. I, I met her through Instagram. She's also on Facebook, but I don't do Facebook anymore. It's just too hard for me to keep up with. So I just, I don't go on Facebook anymore. So, um, I also did, um, way before I did my buddy color with Philomena, I actually did a buddy color with my cousins. Um, for Mother's Day, I gave each of them the Romantic Country by Erie and then a small set of colored pencils. And we were supposed to do a color along uh, from Julie's passion for coloring I sent them the link to it and we were supposed to just follow along to the to the video and I was the only person that finished that one and another buddy color that um that was kind of a fail was with my kids so well, I think it was two Christmases ago we picked our pages from the Christmas coloring book by Christopher Hart and I was the, I was uh, again the only one that finished the coloring so yeah those were my failed ones <laughs> I tried to get family to color with me but yeah I wasn't very successful in that so number six is my first color tube channel you started I started watching who is my first color tube channel I think the first color tube channel, it's, I'm going to say Peta Hewitt because around the same time I also discovered Coloring Queen, Lee, the Coloring Queen, and so, but um, I believe it was Peta Hewitt that was the first one. She's the one I think I was watching that. gave me the push to get the Prismacolor Premier colored pencils. And also I think Chris Chang, was she making videos back then, 2015, 16? Um, I think Chris, Chris Chang also, not sure. But I'm gonna say Peter Hewitt would be my first. So number seven is first page you colored. And that would be from Angie Grace balance with the Pentel color pen. This is the wrong one. Here, so the first page, <laughs> I just used every, I tried to use as much of the colors from the Pentel Arts, and this was in May 4th, 2015. And then here I did, how many colors is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven seven colors <laughs> yeah but yeah so that was my first one it's just like a lot of colors <laughs> and it's from balance by angie grease so number eight what was your first portrait picture you colored my first portrait picture is from astro inklings by Tanya Bond. It is the Aquarius girl. And that was for a color along on Instagram. And it, the color along has already been going on for a while. I think the Astro Inklings just came out and there was a color along where each month they're coloring uh, a different girl for each of the zodiac sign. And I didn't get my book until January for yeah, January 2017 and then I joined that color along with that first portrait picture I've done and that's done with the Prismacolor colored pencils and yeah I really burnished the color in there <laughs> trying to color on the Amazon printed paper I'm, don't remember if it's create space or just Amazon printed paper, but either way, it was really stressful on my hands to color in that kind of paper. I mean, it's doable. It's just a lot of work, a lot of pressure to burnish the colors. 
So number eight, no, that was number eight. Number nine is, what was your first grayscale picture you colored? My first grayscale picture was from Aikuko in her coloring book called Surreal Fantasy. And I think I'll have the picture pop up and it's colored in with Mitsubishi Uni pencils. And yeah, that was my first uh, grayscale. And then number 10 is, what was your first ever completed book? My first ever completed book is The Astro Inklings by Tanya Bond. Because of the color along, I've already completed about half of it. So um, I actually finished the last page last year in 2019. And I do have a video out sharing uh, each of the page. It was from, I think I posted it in January, the completed book video, my video for the completed book. If you want to check that out, I'll also leave a link down below in the video description. And then, so there's one more question, which is the bonus one. What was the first coloring tag you participated in? And the first one I participated in was in 2019, November 2019, and it's a coloring tag. I think there was a list of questions also asking like your favorites, um, favorite books and stuff, favorite illustrators and yeah. So it was a list of questions and it was created I believe by Lisa Loves. But yeah, so that is it. That's the last question. All oh, 11. <laughs> Um, I'm not sure who has been tagged or who has already done a video so I apologize if you've already been tagged or already did the video. I want to tag Lee, the coloring queen. I'm not sure if she watches my video but if she can do this I hope she does. Um, the dynamic duos of uh, KP colors and coloring F. Um, I'm not sure if coloring kid Imogen if you've been tagged yet but if not, I hope you can do this. And also Amberly Silentia. I really love her coloring, so I hope she does this one. And if you have a YouTube channel and would love to do this tag, I hope you do. Please don't wait to get tagged. I believe Jojo opened it to all to participate if they can. I hope that you all enjoyed this video. I thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, please take care, keep safe and healthy, and happy colorings. Bye-bye.